Thank you for joining us today. Uh, do you want to tell me what you brought in? Uh, I brought in three paintings of uh, that was painted during World War II. Mm -hmm. My daddy was a uh, uh, guarded prisoners of war over there in Germany, and uh, there was one particular prisoner that had uh, a, a skill of painting, and he wanted to keep it honed. They had were very short of supplies, and so Daddy dug up some old canvas, tent canvas, and this is what this this one's painted on. And uh, they would use whatever they could, you know, like shoe polish and stuff. This is what my daddy told me, and uh, uh, that's a picture of my daddy, and these two are my mother. Okay, okay, yeah, you know, um, that's not that uncommon. The Obviously, in times of war, you're looking for whatever you can. And especially with this one, you can tell here at the edges, the canvas, uh, and if we flip it over real quick. It's got that old army color to it. Yes, <laughs> olive drab, <laughs> olive green. <laughs> um, so, really interesting, though. And you occasionally see these. Uh, I love the story, actually. Um, and you can tell on these, they are dated during the wartime, 1945. And it looks like, is that January or June? Didn't it? January, maybe. So the war was still going. Yeah. Um, now, don't know much about the artist, unfortunately. Uh, you know, and that happens. Some of these guys get lost to time. But he clearly, he was good, actually. Mm -hmm. I love this one. That's very well painted. A um, little primitive obviously in the framing and everything. The conditions kind of falling apart. Not unexpected for being, it's been what, 70 years since 1945? Yes, and especially on the material that it's on. <laughs> yes, uh. um, but very well painted, very nice. Um, see your mom's name there, got the pins and all that. Mm -hmm. Now, what you're really looking at um, with you you don't have any documentation, do you? Just your comments? No, story. just the story Daddy told me. And then when uh, when I was moving around, he, he said, Bonnie, you want these uh, pictures? <laughs> and I didn't want to hurt his feeling. I really didn't want them. But I said, sure, <laughs> OK. I'll take them. And they've been kind of floating around my in my housing ever since. <laughs> <laughs> Good. Well, you know, what you're looking at, um, obviously, being your family, <laughs> They're going to be more sentimental to you. But people do love the story. And so value-wise, you are looking at uh, 1000 $1,500. you got to be kidding. <laughs> are you Were happy these with old that? ones? <laughs> yeah. You may want to clean them up, but... Yeah. I wouldn't know how. <laughs> well, I mean, because they are kind of falling apart. <laughs> I suggest you get a professional, but... <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah. I have one that uh, of my Aunt Shirley when she was really small, and it got kind of really damaged, and it's actually my favorite one, ah. but it's got tore. <laughs> well, thank you for bringing these in today. Well, you're welcome. Huh. Thank you. Ooh. Thousand to fifteen hundred. <laughs>